Hello, everybody. I am joined by the general manager here of the Intercontinental. Now, the last time we were here in Bucharest, the event was somewhere much, much farther away, much deeper in. It was mm. still very cool, but the second I walked into this room, I was totally impressed. It's such a stunning venue. So first of all, you told me there's a little story but behind this room. Give me give me the story. Well, listen, it's it's a very historical room. The hotel is very historic. It's, it was built in 1971. So you can imagine in the 70s, uh, Romania was, was not that open to the world, you know. And and this this room here was used as a cinema hall by all the big celebrities and politicians who came in from abroad because, you know, Hollywood movies at that time were also not, not allowed, let's say. Uh, and behind this beautiful painting, you still have the original screen from 1971. Stop. Oh, my goodness. Well, the taxi driver, when I was coming in, was kind of telling me that this, this was, has been a hot spot for, for ages. But, you know, putting on a poker tournament is has its whole unique set, I think, of, of difficulties and also things like bringing in a, a different, you know, unique clientele. Mm -hmm. So talk to me a little bit about what it's been like to, to put this whole thing together. Well, look, we are very open for, for new businesses and something we have established here over the last couple of years is a very strong collaboration and partnership with PokerFest. And, um, you know, it's, it's good for everyone. It's a win-win situation for, po for PokerFest because they're exposed to a very unique property as well. And for us, it's very good because we, we are dealing with a different type of clientele, as you said. If, if I would say they are the typical intercontinental guests, maybe not now, but maybe in the future. And this is where we're trying to impress them and to get their buy-in as red to, or is already to get to, to become our new future generation of guests. I'm I'm on board already. You had me at Intercontinental like age, ages ago. Well, have you guys have you come into certain I think obstacles or difficulties in figuring out how to sort of put this whole thing together? It seems like it's been completely seamless. I think it is it is, you know, the whole planning around it and we were in touch already a couple of months ago, so the whole logistical part, the organizational part, there were a lot of meetings around it from our side from the banketing teams, uh, but at the end of the day if if we understand each other and we know what what is needed, it it was done without any any issues at all. And you know, the great partnership we're having we have a very uh, open communication we are very transparent and we talk about challenges as well there are challenges in everything but it's about overcoming them and seeing them as opportunities and yeah this is what we made happen I've been super surprised even in fact just I was walking around this morning and seeing places that are that are available for poker kind mm -hmm. of all all over and I think that for most people they wouldn't realize what a sort of burgeoning economy they have here so do you think for a lot of Romanian people do they actually all play poker and gamble? I don't think that they all play poker, but I think the, the trend goes very much to the direction that they're enjoying being a part of it, being it observant at the moment or later on active players. You know, I worked in Malta before, and, and Malta was, was an island 10, 15 years ago where nobody would have ever thought that this would become a casino destination or a poker tournament destination. It, it will come. It's just an educational process, and in a couple of years, this is uh, embedded into the culture as well. I love it. I can't wait. I'll keep coming back, that's for sure. I've so enjoyed it. And I'll keep coming back to the Intercontinental. Even when I first got there, the gentleman was like, do you want wine? Do you want points? What do you want? I said, this is, this is where I want to stay. This is where I'm at. Thank you guys so much. Of course, stay tuned for the rest of our coverage here from the 888 Live in Bucharest.